So hello guys welcome back to the channel I hope you all are absolutely fine and sound and in the 5 day AI agent intensive course many of you are facing issues like creation of the API key and you are getting some kind of error we will cover this do not worry about it and one more important thing basically the course for the day 1 and day 2 the assignments are already live on the channel you have to come over here you can see the assignments are live if you come to the courses page you can see here I have made the complete course playlist now here you can see 1a okay you can see the 1a d1a and 1b both are separately shared over here but many of you are reporting that we are getting some kind of error and we want a single video so for them only I have created a day one single video it is shooted basically today only I shooted it now here basically you can just see and understand all the things basically how we have to run it what we are doing in this course and in the assignment so if you want a detailed guide you should watch this video and if you are willing just to complete it you can watch these two videos and complete the day one challenge now day two challenge is also live on the channel and on the basically the curriculum also you can see day two 2a two and 2b both the parts are available you can watch it now let's come to the main topic here is the how you have to set the gen as google ai studio so we have to come over here and here you can see it's showing ai studio setup you have to right click over here and open it on a new tab another thing is that we are opening the basic first module will open to help you understand all the things okay so here uh, i think by default i am signed in so i'm just signing in out so i will show you what is the next process so by default when you will open the ai dots sorry aistudio.google.com and the welcome page will look like this here you have to just click on the get started and then you have multiple methods you can use the email account or just use the google account so now let me just use the google account over here now here it's asking for password you have to enter your gmail password and after you have entered the password you have to click on the next option you'll be redirected particularly here as it's a part of google so basically if you are signed in with gmail it will automatically just sign in automatically so here you can see the api key is already generated for me i am showing you a quick demo how to generate the api key now if you come over here to the module the first thing is that you have to click on edit my copy so here you will get this prompt and uh, wait for the notebook to get loaded. So many of you are asking can we complete this challenge with mobile. So basically I am seeing difficulties in just selecting the boards. So if you are able to do it then it's well and good. But if you are not do able to do it you can try in Chrome browser desktop version. Okay. So finally here all these things are live. You can see here we did not need to submit the assignment so come over here click on add-ons click on secrets and here by default my google api key is created so if i am creating a new api key let me delete it so that i am able to help you so i have to delete it and then so it's not deleting so it's finally deleted okay now let me close it so you have to click on add on secrets and then it will ask for add secret now here we have to add a secret so for that come over here you can see create a new secret label with google api key copy the name from here okay and paste in the label and for the value you have to create a new api key so let's come to the google ai studio you have signed in now here by default if you are seeing this by default there will be blank page you have to click on create api key now you can name your api key you can name anything in the api key like here i'm naming it my name only so now you have to select a project if you are using for personal project you can import the project here or you can just create a fresh project over here so here i am just writing it so you can write it anything unless they have mentioned that you have to create the project in the name as far as all the day one and day two assignment is concerned there is no requirement so just click on it and just create the api key over here okay now here uh, we have to just click on create key and a new api key will be generated and one more query is which many people were asking do we need to regenerate api key for each task basically 
uh, one A module also and if you are completing in day two, then also we have to create the API key. So the answer is no. If you are facing some error, then only you have to create it. So here is the API key, copy it, come over here and paste in the value. So just paste it and click on save. So finally API key is enabled. Now by default what will happen? Sometimes the API key is not enabled. Okay, sometimes the API key is not enabled. Then you will get this kind of error. Authentication error. Please make sure you have added the API key. Let me show you the error over here if I am able to show you. So basically for the first time the session starting time is more. It takes time to start. So you need to wait for it. And one more thing sometimes due to traffic you may get this kind of issue like it will show waiting for the next available notebook so you need to wait for some time because yesterday we were facing this issue only now the session is running and here you can see that we are getting this error authentication error make sure you have added the API key but you have already added the API key so here you have to make sure that this checkbox is selected now if you run it you will get the output that Gemini API key is is set okay now here you can see the API key is successfully set and we can move ahead if you want to move ahead you can come to the channel and you can just follow the tutorials all are available on the courses section you can just complete it and just you'll be able to complete the assignment and there is no submission also one more important thing as I said uh, that if you are getting if you are getting uh, okay do not type anything I'm just showing an example resource exhausted error if you are getting okay if you are getting this error then you can just do one thing do not delete the api key you have to simply click on edit secrets come over here wait a second come over here create api key similarly you have to create it and try if you are not getting any rate limit or basically resource exhausted error you can use the same api key again and again only thing you need to make sure that this checkbox is selected so this is the main thing i wanted to share so this was the quick update do like the video and subscribe the channel and many of you are asking is there any other courses and events so here the jni academy is also live you can watch it and just participate it it's also giving some course free of cost and certificates too second is that this one okay you can see this one that is basically Google Cloud Arcade program and all the things are mentioned over here how to start how to just complete you can watch this video and just enhance your skills too so this was the quick thing do like the video and subscribe the channel guys thank you have a great day